You too, what's up? It's Hood's King Sean, and we back again with another classic. You know, on this channel, we talk about personal credit, we talk about business credit, we talk about anything that can help you and your family get to the next level. So if you would like a one-on-one -on -one with me, all you need to do is hit the description right below this video, hit my site, pick your day and time, and we can lock in on that personal side or on that business side and really turn you up for 2023. So all those that still interested in getting my ultimate credit repair guide, all you gotta do, that will be in the description, or you could go straight to my website at whoiskingshawn.com and go ahead and download your ebook. So today, I'm gonna be showing you how you could get a business line of credit up to 150,000. Now, before we even get into this product, I'm gonna let you know, I recently went on and applied for this business line of credit a couple of days ago, as you see right above, that's the email I got letting me know I was approved. I was recently approved for $30,000. Now, if I would have built a relationship with them through my years in business, and maybe this was like my third time, I probably could have got about 75 to 100,000. But this was my first time and I was approved for $30,000. Not bad. Again, I'm going to show you the steps I needed to do to get that $30,000 business line of credit. So right here. Get a business line of credit up to 150,000. Apply for Funbox line of credit to help your expenses like payroll, buying inventory, purchase, raw materials, maintenance, and more. And again, as you see right here, credit line amount. Rates and terms are based on the credit worthiness and subject to change. So let's go right down here. Quick application. I'm gonna show you my whole process. I'm gonna tell you my whole process steps I need to do to get approved for that $30,000 business line of credit. Apply is quick and easy and can you could get a decision in little as three minutes. Now my whole process um, from beginning to end was roughly about a 12 hour window. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna walk you through that. Let me just show you the whole process you need to do. Fast access to fund, right? Funds can be available as soon as the next business day if approved and that is, <laughs> that is true because that's how I got it. Um, flexible repayment terms, choose your repayment plan each time you draw funds with a no prepayment penalty. Let's scroll right down here. And you want to know these are the questions randomly that people want to know do i qualify i mean you got to be based in the u.s excuse me um have at least a 600 credit score right business checking account right ideally you need to be in business for at least six months or more you know if you're thinking about even applying for them so um that's something that you need to keep in mind and then i always tell you look for the trust pilot trust pilot is the key and as you see rated 4.7 out of five stars. Now let's go over my steps I needed to do to uh, get approved, right? Let's just go over here to the application. So now um, what they're gonna do, you're gonna fill out your personal information. Once you fill out your personal information, it's gonna take you to another window. It's gonna take you to a window where you need to fill out your business information. You will be putting your social security, even though it's not gonna be a hard pull, just bear with me, right? You will be connecting your business checking account because your approval is going to go off of what your company made in the last 90 days and your credit score is going to be all in one. You know, it's not only going to be um, how much you're making and it's not off, let's say 2002 or 2001 It's only going to be from your last 90 days. Um, that's how they actually going to. Um, see how your approval is going to be, you know, if you're going to get high, if you're going to get that 150 or 100,000 or that 50,000 or that 30,000 or that 15 or that 10 at five. I have seen people as little as getting approved for 2,500. Again, it's going to depend on your company and your business and what y'all generated in the past 90 days. And at the same time, they will be doing a soft pull on your credit report just to see you know they got to see what they're working with um these companies just not going to just be giving you money left to right so once i connected my bank account after i filled out my personal i filled out my business um i connected my bank account um they told me that they will let me know um soon as they get an answer i uh, went to sleep woke up the next morning 
once I woke up, I seen the approval for the $30,000. Like I said, these are the kind of companies you want to keep in your back pocket. Do I need to use the $30,000 business line of credit? No. Why? Because I got plenty of other fundings. I got plenty of business credit cards, but I stack them. Remember, that's the goal. Stack everything you available. You're not going to be charged anything. So that $30,000 business line of credit I got, I won't be charged one penny until I withdraw. So let's say today um, I buy a property, right? I need to rehab it. The rehab is going to be about uh, ten to 20000 whatever it may be right so let's say I'm gonna withdraw 15,000 I will go right on my dashboard on the fun box right and I will what withdraw 15,000 and that 15,000 will be sent to my business checking account right so every month after that that I'm carrying that balance I'm gonna be charged an interest on that balance of that 15,000 not that you know total of 30,000 so it's kind of giving you a good idea so I could keep this I'm just gonna keep it you know in there have access to it so when I need it I have other business lines of credit um other ones for 40 other ones for 50 another one for 75 I have a business line of credits sitting there so when it's time to do the work um any rehabbing any of uh, buying any properties or anything I'm doing in business I have access to that money so I always tell you fix your personal credit, get it right, and then once you build your business credit, start applying for these business lines of credit. Now, I'm gonna be honest, this was very easy um, to get approved. Like I said, my whole process probably was 12 hours, simple, easy, and they will be asking you on that business side, they will be asking for your EIN number because they will be checking. They gotta check everything. Like I said, these people is just not gonna give you money for no reason. They need to see that you have you have a actually business and you are generating money monthly. So, you know, keep that in mind, man. So overall, I would say um, for, I never did a video on Funbox. It was something I always wanted to get into. Um, so I started doing some research I started reaching out to them, um, speaking to, you know, customer service, getting a kind of overview of how they work. And I said the other day, let me go ahead and try. And they proved me for the $30,000 business line of credit. So, you know, like I said, I have it there. So when I do need use in it, but like I said, I got a lot of avenues for other business line of credit. So again, people, fix your personal credit score. Fix your personal credit score and start building a strong business side because you could keep all that debt on the business side and keep your personal score clean keep your utilization people telling you keep your utilization under 30 please don't be listening to that people keep that credit utilization between one and four percent when you trying to go get fundings from these banks just think about it on your personal side if you had your credit utilization at 27 percent right banks are very smart <laughs> let me just let you know that so if you come to them and you asking for 15 20 30 40 50 thousand dollars right they look at your credit utilization your credit utilization is at 25 percent um just know they know if you um break your ankle if you get sick and you out of work it's very good from that 25 percent utilization could go up to 30 40 50 60 70. so again I always promote it keep your credit utilization between one and four percent that's the goal right there once um these businesses out here and they see your credit utilization is sitting between that one and four percent and you showing them that you do not need their money people please stop listening to people that tell you to keep your credit utilization under 30 you know what i mean keep it between one and four percent so overall so far with funbox i'm not using a business line of credit but i eventually will be using them and just let you know before i get up out of here you will not get a hard inquiry pull but you will get that hard inquiry pull the first time you withdraw money so let's say um i got it sitting around for three months right i have no hard inquiry at all but today i need to pull out twelve thousand. once i withdraw that first initial payment from that i will be what I will get a hard inquiry at that point. So yes, it is a no credit check, but once you are approved, no longer how long it sits, once you withdraw that first initial payment out of that, 
you will get a hard earned carry. So that's this, you know, something I wanted to give you an overview about my uh, experience with Funbox so far. I will give you an update later down the line once I use it and, you know, run it up to 50,000 and to eventually 100,000 and more. And, um, eventually get that 150,000. So, get in the comments. Tell me what you think. If you have a relationship with Funbox, get in the comments. Tell me what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. But for now, I'm up out of here. Peace.